So we just got back from Target. We are pretty much just getting the stuff that we're gonna need for 2017, at least just to start planning what are our goals and stuff like that. And in order for me to be organized with my thoughts, kinda know my priorities and whatsoever, there's a few things that I bought. Uh, I got a planner and I also got a dust calendar along with a gym phone tripod. I'm gonna set up and see how it is. This is how it looks like and um, it was about five dollars which is not bad honestly and it's supposed to be uh, flexible and whatsoever so I'm gonna set it up see if I like it if I don't I'm gonna return it but hopefully it helps because I'm vlogging out of my phone as well okay so let's see so it looks like this in the box and this is the thing that holds the um, camera you can see it's stretchable to it interesting okay let's set it up <laughs> okay let's put this on Oh, it is actually pretty nice <laughs> seeing if it's moving anyway so this is the dust calendar that I got it is pink with polka dots on there and I feel like it's totally me so that's the reason why I got this one it was for ten dollars but yes this is going to be very very helpful because I'm starting to mark off my days now and trying to like try to make sure that every day has a purpose so this calendar is going to be very very helpful and the next thing that I got from Target is dun, 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 dun. if you guys can see this is super super unique I love it and inside it's golden polka dotted and yeah so it has like pockets which I kind of like because I take a lot of notes so I could just put them in there instead of lines this time it's just like blank like that which is totally fine because I honestly don't really write in between the lines <laughs> so this is gonna be super neat and the reason why I got this one is because it matches with my little notebook <coughs> this one it is super super cute and I love, love, love everything about it. Um, I love how it has two pockets, one pocket here and one pocket here. Um, and this is like pretty much, you could take it out, put new ones in there. I also got this pen from, um, it comes with two pen and it is from Target as well. And it was for $5. I really like it and I really enjoy the, the, this pen. I can just put it right here and then I'm on the go. So we are going to discuss more about what my goals are and that's going to happen on the next clip. I hope you guys enjoy this video. Good evening YouTube family. Welcome to Mao Chu's channel. If you guys are new to this channel, please don't forget to subscribe. Alright, so we are going to go ahead and begin in regards to what today's title is all about. Obviously you guys can see it's about new year, new me. And we are here today to talk about my new year's resolution for 2017. We should really evaluate about 2016, however, we failed. So we didn't resolve anything, so there was no New Year's resolution there. I think we did one for 2015, but we never really did one for 2016. That's why we're still on plateau. Yeah, about that. Let's begin. Oh yeah, and if you guys haven't realized this, that my hair is black. Yes. I definitely did dye it. If you guys follow me on Snapchat, you guys wouldn't have missed that because Snapchat saw it first. Okay, you can be honest. If I look like totally emo, you can definitely tell me that because I look pretty emo. But yeah, if you guys want to, you guys can definitely, you know, follow me on Snapchat. That way you guys get the latest and greatest updates on me. <laughs> and also follow me on Instagram. It's on there, my personal. Snapchat, Facebook, YouTube, you get the gist of it. First of all, we would like to talk about spending time with family. My goals for 2017 is to spend more time with family because I feel like in 2016, I did not spend enough time with family. 
I felt like I lost a chunk of time with my family. I missed a lot of birthdays, a lot of family occasions, a lot of family meetings that it would have been nice to kind of keep myself updated, but I was being a really bad girl, not going home as much as I want to, but there's a whole personal reason behind that. A lot of it just has to deal with my relationship with the men that I'm with now. Not that they don't get along, it's just more of why we shouldn't be together, and some people approve, some people disapprove, and me being there is going to cause some awkward vibe and I didn't want that very much. One excuse came after another and I felt miserable. I did not really like myself very much because I know that I'm a very family oriented person and I lost a big part of me and that was love and family. Uh, my parents are getting older and you never know when their time is going to come and you never know when anybody's time is going to come. You can be young and also your life could just flash like that right before your eyes and then you're gone. This year I'm going to make the effort to visit my family more and spend more quality time with my family and my friends. Next one is evaluating and work on self. So I do very well plan on working on myself and reevaluating my goals every Sunday for the fact that I don't do it enough. I honestly think that a lot of us do not do it enough because without having to reevaluate ourselves, we lose track of our goals, our dreams, and our ambitions, and our motivations, and our drives. Like we lose a lot of that if we don't reevaluate ourselves. I figure every Sunday after I come back from the gym when my mind is right and I have a cup of tea in front of me and I'm relaxed and calm, I want to be able to use that time wisely to sit down and reevaluate my goals, see what it is that I need to work on, see what it is that I have already improved on, and what I can do to improve myself even 10 times better. Next step. Ace all my classes. As far as going to school for 2017 and spring semester, I'm going to be taking physiology, chemistry, anthropology, and I think that's it. I will be going for the nursing program if you guys haven't watched my previous videos, but that's what I'm going to be going in for. I do plan on taking more courses during the summer if I don't. Most likely I'm just going to find a dead end job to work at, maybe one that's going to work with my schedule so that I can still go to work and also go to school at the same time, but we shall see about that. If not, I'm just going to do work study, that way I can switch it up every semester or so. I'm going to go in the perspective of an A student. Um, I've tried this out with Anatomy and oh my goodness, like it is amazing, like the laws of attraction is so true and it works so well. Like I put in all the time, all the effort, everything I had, I put it in. I went in with the vision of an A student and I came out an A student. Like I was so stoked about it. Um, even till today, like I feel like that is my biggest success, honestly, is to be able to put in so much time and effort and to actually see that back in return. Philosophy that I'll be using from here on out and that is to learn the material, Apply it, mesmerize it, know it, teach it, and then relearn it. That's the only way you're going to go about the semester. That's the only way you're going to pass is if you do all that. And I know for a fact that as long as I put in all the time and effort into it, I'm definitely going to ace all my courses. I believe in myself and I know that I can do it because I saw for myself for, with anatomy. There is no way for me to fail with a B and chemistry and physiology. Like that is not a possibility. That cannot happen. If it happens, that only means that I did not use my time wisely and I doubted in myself. That's it, as simple as that. Next step is we are going to vlog more. That's if my education doesn't get in the way. I can tell you this much that it is going to be crazy. I'm gonna have to um, you know, find value in my time and make time for everything as much as possible. I want to be able to at least, at least put one to two videos up for you guys. Um, I know that I should be doing at least two to three videos, but I just know for a fact that it's going to be a crazy semester, a crazy year. It might be hectic too along the way, but I'm gonna 
you know, hope for the best and expect the worst to happen. I don't see myself straying too far away from that. Within one or two videos, I should be able to post that up for you guys and kind of keep you guys updated of my life of what's going on. Another goal for vlogging is that I do also plan on having three to five giveaways um, for next year and they're going to be a value of 20 to $50. It's because I want to be able to give back to especially my followers, my loyal followers, the ones who always watch my videos. If you want to uh, be entered into these giveaway, uh, be sure to subscribe to your girl and also like this video. Comment down below too on what you guys like to see and if you guys give this video a thumbs up, I would really really appreciate it. It would really really definitely help me. Last two, travel more. I do want to travel more next year, however that only depends on if it fits in with my crazy chaotic schedule next year, but I mean this year, and also be able to try new things, meet new friends, make new friends, and also still remember and also hang out with my old friends as well. Do adventurous things, I mean that's just, that's always how I've been, that's always who I am, and I would definitely love to be able to do that again. Because last year we went to Arizona, it was so cool. I got to see my best friend and it was such a nice get together. Even though it was only a couple hours with her, it was still so, 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 so worth it. All right guys, here to the last one. Fitness and health. In regards to fitness, I believe I found the secret to weight loss. So if you want to know what the secret to weight loss is, like this video. And also, you want to see an episode of me explaining to you guys what the secret to weight loss is. It's actually the simplest knowledge that you guys would actually ever known, and it probably everybody says that on the on the internet, but you never really had it breaking it down to you, like what works for you, what doesn't. And it really depends on how your body works and interacts with it too. But what works for me so far and it has been truly amazing is. I can't tell you. It has to be on the next episode. Make sure to like this damn video, comment down below, and let me know if that's the video that you want to see. And also subscribe to your girl. Push the notification button, which is the bell. What is this? That way you guys will get a notification whenever my video does get uploaded for you guys. And also it's not only going to be for that one, it's going to be for the giveaways, it's going to be for many, many, many more to come. I would also like to increase my weight and lifting weights. I want to be able to hit more PRs this year. I will do a separate video in regards to my new workout split and also incorporating more HIIT cardio into my exercises. In regards to my health, I want to be able to continue to do my detox that I've been doing. The next video is going to be in regards to my detox drinks, so make sure to, I cannot stress this enough, like push the, the subscription button, also the notification button on because I want you guys to be able to see all my content that I have for you guys because they are so, they're knowledgeable, they're the most trending stuff that I want you guys to know. Sharing knowledge with you guys and fun facts with you guys is what I'm here and it's what I'm all about. So yeah, I'll be also continuing to eat healthy, eating clean and uh, try to possibly incorporate a paleo diet into my clean eating too. If you guys want to see, I was thinking about doing a season of one month period of no processed food, no sugar drinks like my red, my red Bull. I am going to miss my Red Bull, but eliminate that, eliminate sugar drinks, uh, eliminate processed food, anything that comes in a bag or a box, like those need to go. So if you guys want to see a season of that, just hit the subscription button put on your notification that way you never miss a video with me ever again if you guys want to see a short season of that episode or those episode of you know my one month of no processed food no sugary drink comment down below too as regard to the season or the episode that you guys wanted to see and if you guys want to see both go and just put episode and season both down on the comment down below and I'll be sure to post that up for you guys there you will be able to see my results and my opinion for a whole month see how that goes see if I even survive but yeah guys that is it for this episode I hope you guys enjoyed it. Do not forget to subscribe to your girl. Give it a thumbs up. And comment down below what season or episode y'all would like to see. Damn. 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 You already know what to do. Don't forget to share this video too. Or else.
live every day with purpose, and love everyone wholeheartedly. To 2017, guys. I'll see you guys on the next one. Bye, guys.